That is Miss Elliot, courtesy of DJ Rajiz on the desk. Welcome to Hip Hop Thursday again. Uh, uh, remember the time frame is still 10.30. In the party Facebook, you can use it to at Y254. And uh, we have a question for you. So let's make this uh, day even hotter. Now, Mliski Lengoria, Joe Story na MCSK, and how much peanuts the artist got paid. And they went all ranting on social media, speaking of how much they got 2,530. That is definitely peanuts. So we asked for your feedback. Now, Mume come through, Willem Bayambaka. So we have Jumbo G, and I said, I also didn't like the story. Kenya to Nafa to Saidiane to Fikefa, but to Kianza story, Kahizi. Then we have, uh, this is one, uh, one fan of Hip Hop Thursday, and I talk to Jafana, Apo uh, ni Elcero. Okay, so from Elcero Village, Kapisa, Kapisanga Ward, Nandi County watching, uh, Big Up Sana Kiplagat. Then we have Oguel Junior, Anasema watching, thank you very, thank you very much, Junior. Then to Konamungina, Ana Ito, Umbra Mwakio. This is more of an insult. And most artists uh, who got that amount, they agree with you, Umbra. Then you have Frederick Smart F. Ndumbizi, and Asema Tukopamoja, Y254. And then Nicheze uh, Kibao, Radio Love, Yanadia Mokami. I'm not sure DJ Rajis can do that right now, but make sure you tuned in uh, right here at Y254 channel. Uh, Period of Kesho. Kesho is freestyle, uh, freestyle Friday? Yeah, yeah. yeah so make sure uh, uh, VDJ Khalifa will definitely have you on uh, Radio Love by Nadia Mukami. Welcome back at Michelle Ashira is where you can find me. And this is the time I introduce to you to an artist who his vision of hip hop is quite different. And he's, he has actually spoken about claiming that most of Kenyans do not get him and the fact that uh, they assume. They don't relate to his kind of music because he's different and he has cut a niche for himself, incorporating fuse, fusing uh, jazz music with uh, hip hop. I'm speaking of none other than Jambro. Finoche. Finoche, <laughs> there he is. Introduce yourself. Yeah. So, but for me, I have spoken to you and I feel like we've known each other like forever. <laughs> <laughs> this one? Yes, come here for is yours. Yeah, Take what's it. good, guys? My name is Finoche Elba Meso, also known as Finoche or p -dot. I'm a self-produced, I'm a self-taught producer and artist. Um, I'm doing, I'm, ma I'm majorly focusing on soul hip-hop, jazz hip-hop, and poetic rap. Okay. Yeah. Jazz hip-hop, soul hip-hop. Yeah. Is that like, um, to you, did you take it as a, prior to even studying your career? as an artist, mm. was it um, a conscious decision so that you can cut a niche for yourself in the industry? Yeah, yeah. I wanted to do something unique and I wanted to do something that uh, I love. Mm -hmm. I'm a fanatic of old school music. I listen to a lot of jazz music. I'm a fan of Frank Sinatra, Nina Simone, you know, those old school artists, Kina Daudi Kabak. I also mm -hmm. listen to them because I want to, I want to come up with my own genre. Live alone, just hip hop and soul hip hop. I want to sample Zilizo Pendwa and bring some some soul and jazz vibe and come up with my genre. That is you know. the way to go because yeah. currently uh, there's competition in each and every industry. Yeah. And the best way you can uh, cut across is if you are different and people mm. actually love what you do. Yeah, yeah. And uh, if you're putting in the work and mm. uh, experience. So like, let's go back uh, when you were growing up. What kind of music were you? Were you around? What kind of music were you listening to that influenced uh, mm. you to desire uh, or rather have the passion to get into music? First, um, I was raised in the church. Like my mom used to take me to church. So basically, I used to listen to a lot of gospel music. Then, with the time, my friend, who is called Mosh, mm -hmm. actually, I think that guy, Manze Sana, is the one. He ended up if you like. He introduced me to hip hop. Okay. The first artist he introduced me to was Nas. All right. So that's where it all started. 
So it all started from uh, way back, mm -hmm. listening to uh, in the church. Yeah, in yeah, church. I, I used Loving to sing in the church. <laughs> sing in the church. Yeah. And how is your parents taking the whole situation of it being, uh, apart from uh, um, um, you're studying international relations in school, yeah. uh, what is, do they support your new yeah, yeah. diversion of uh, yeah, yeah. your career, Una apart from just taking bonda. your careers <laughs> international relations and now into music? Uh, are yeah. they supporting yeah, right yeah, now? Yeah, they're supporting me like, they supporting me um nikiwaambia niko na event naenda pali mm -hmm. like they'll give me permission okay. to go and that with them just giving me permission to go mm -hmm. out mm -hmm. they're supporting me like they know i'm chasing something all right yeah. and also when i make beats i produce my own tracks the first you produce your own yeah. tracks. Yeah, yeah, I produce my own songs like uh, from know, African Lover to oh, Money. African Lover was produced by my friend. He's called Pinkuzola. He's okay. a YouTuber mm -hmm. and also a producer. And I should do a pachini. So, what was your mental state yeah. when you went to studio to do your first song? Because uh, yeah. I've, I've, I've sat with many artists and they, uh, they always have different story mm -hmm. about, about going to the, the studio for the first time and releasing their first jam, yeah. uh, the package, the finances are used to incorporate in the whole production. Mm. What was your mental state when you were going to the studio for the first time and you're now releasing your, your first jam? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like first, <laughs> I want okay. to record this project All right. and after I record it, I want to post it on SoundCloud, mm -hmm. YouTube and this, this truck is going to hit like, I'm going to blow like all over the world. And this truck is going to hit like, I'm going to blow but it turned out to be the other. It was different. <laughs> what, how was the yeah. re reception? Mm. Like people didn't love it. Okay, a from that people, state of mm. uh, f expecting to have a hit tune mm. to now, okay, life has just hit you left, right and center. Okay, hold up, what's going on? Mm. So what was your, after, after that? Mm. I had to learn. I had to learn the music, mm. the music itself. Mm -hmm. And I had to learn the music industry of Kenya. Okay. And I had to learn how people will relate to the music that I'm doing outside. Okay, so let's speak about your African lover. Mm. Uh, it's, uh, it's no more of hip-hop, but mm. uh, it's, uh, it's still your project. It's more of a fro. Mm. So you're basically what you're trying to tell us in your, in your art, mm. from African lover to love, to now the one that I love a lot is, okay, apart from money, there's a lot, couple of others. We have nightmares. Yeah. So are you still... Um, exploring or are you just uh, you're sure that now it's just uh, apart from you exploring mm. different uh, agendas incorporating hip-hop to jazz soul music mm. so you're still doing a four or no. are we exploring we go no, with exploring. I'm, right now i'm doing hip-hop you're doing hip-hop yeah good mm. talk to me about nightmares oh nightmares nightmares actually it's one of my best projects because it's my story all right I used to be, I used to, I used to be depressed mm -hmm. and okay. stressed and I had this negative energy behind my back. So I had just to put it all down to the sheets, went to the studio, recorded it. Then I had to plan for a video. I recorded Nightmares last year, February. Okay. So you're fab. <laughs> I and used to, I used to do work actually, your time. Like, I used to feel worthless. Worthless. I right. pay. I used to be a waiter. Mm -hmm. I used to work to a you warehouse. You somewhere, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I used to work to a warehouse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, KLB. Mm -hmm. I used to carry boxes up mm -hmm. a visa. So, it was a bit hard and challenging to me. Na I was kachini na juliza. Manze kwa nimi liko sanini. Niko na art. Like, I can write. I can record. I can produce. But, kwa nimi nilifanya nye... Wasewezi, like, nisikiza wasemetu, eh, umsia kuna talent, mm -hmm. let's give him a, a chance. Yeah. So, nilisema, acha tu nienike history yangu down. Mm -hmm. Then, it's nika shia na wase. We actually had this conversation mm -hmm. earlier on our intro, speaking about uh, artists going through depression, mm -hmm. and wale artists from Nigeria, mm -hmm. uh, is actually speaking about uh, having an insurance, mm -hmm. medical insurance, mm -hmm. insurance on mental health mm -hmm. as an artist. Mm -hmm. And you have brought it up, and it's very important for an artist mm -hmm. to have this particular mental insurance, supporting Wale throughout. Mm -hmm. So how did you move from uh, being depressed to coming up with another good music, such mm -hmm. as money? I just had to keep my head up, stick my chest out, 
and handle it all. Did you have a support system? Did you speak to someone? Yeah, yeah, I have a close friend. Tulisoma mm -hmm. Pamuja and I from primary school, actually, and I knew what to say. Shout out to Luno. Yes, big up to you. Yeah. So the guy is my close friend, like Kabisa. Mm -hmm. Kutoka kwa familia, okay. he's my second family. Like, mm -hmm. he listens to me. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, just do your music. Mm -hmm. It will pay off. And it's actually paying off. Exactly. And speaking yeah. about paying it off, mm -hmm. you have a new EP coming out. You yeah, have yeah. actually moved from self this. Self-produced. Yes, yeah, self-produced. Yeah. And EP is coming out. It's yeah. called Kibs Era title. Kibs Era, yeah. yeah. So it's coming on uh, October 25th. Of October. Okay, speak about uh, Kibbs era. Let me not be a snitch. That's right. <laughs> you, nah, yo, nah, nah. let it just oh, be right here. No, the first time, I take it Thursday. Why? Come <laughs> on. <laughs> just a snippet. Um, what should people expect? Um, and where, where are you going to launch it officially? Yes. Because we, are, we, we will actually love if we could mm. launch it right here. I'm, a, I'm, I'm actually planning on where I'm going to launch it. Mm -hmm. But Kibbs era, it's actually my story. Kibbs era has two meanings. Mm -hmm. First, Kibera mm -hmm. in 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 Nubi in right. Nubi it means jungle or forest. Okay. Then then Kibzera in the other meaning means mm -hmm. kilobytes error. Nili gaonisha to your word Kibs then error kilobytes error. I'm the kilobytes Aye. and it's my error. So the projects in Yiziko up with you too. Like I'm trying to show you people who I am. Mm -hmm. I've talked about. I've talked about my dream of getting played in the radio. Yes. I've talked about... And you're on TV live yeah, right yeah, now? Yeah. Uh -huh. Mama, so we, we made have it. We've talked about <laughs> depression. Yeah. And how I'm you talking came out about, of it. I'm talking about this fine girl that I'm going to have All throughout right. my entire life. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about new days. I mean, brighter days mm -hmm. that the Lord has upon me in the future. Preach, brother. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about, you know, yes. I'm talking about depression. Like, yeah. I'm just... Telling the world and people that this is me. This is you. Yeah. Okay. I don't care if people are going to love the project or not. But You're doing it for you. Yeah, I'm for doing the love it for of music. Me. Yeah. All and right. that is me. Period. Okay. Guys, uh, people back at home, they're coming up with your uh, your comments are coming. We have Joseph Wayne, Jay. Uh, I'll be reading these comments, but uh, right about now, finish it. Give out your social media handles because I believe... Uh, people through your art, mm. they can actually learn and understand that it's not as easy as people claim to be. Yeah. or think it is in the mm. industry mm. and they can learn one or two things on how to go about it mm. and just uh, have a good time while at it and mm. exploring so use camera four give us your social media handles as we let you do your thing right here yeah mm -hmm. mm. everywhere it's finoche yelba just as simple as that soundcloud youtube itunes tidal deezer like ig facebook twitter everywhere it's finoche yelba you have any message for your fans? What should they expect? Or any? Uh, do they you have know, a new event? I usually <laughs> talk to them. <laughs> well, I do. Yeah, so, I do. But see, well, finish up. I'm going to tell you what he brings to the table. Make sure you stay tuned. Uh, new, uh, new. You'll be, you be uh, doing your new single right yeah, here. Yeah, my. Yeah, so. He'll be performing. Make sure you don't touch that dial. Remember, you're still speaking about the MCSK drama whereby artists got paid uh, peanuts. So, 2000. <laughs> 530 still ongoing on our Facebook page that is Y254 channel. We have one Joseph Wayne J and Asema Zimmerman blocked. Thank you very much, Zain. And then, um, Jose Bana here is Tony Gori Sana. Hi, Bam Biata. Oh, what want to support the whole idea of not it's not good for uh, what the artist got in terms of the, the pay. We have Azino Technician MCSK OG as must be okay. The OG must be respected. Then we have Sophie Ru. How are you, my people? We are good. Then he is she Akulipa Wasani, what an equal amount in a bow. It doesn't make any sense at all. Alafu OG should be respected, Bana. And then uh, Napenda songs is uh, Uyo Jama. Okay, Sijuni Jama Mgani. I believe ni Jama Mwenyana come through. So easy and it will feel no shape, but Ule Jama Mwengelea ni sawa. And then we have Alberto Sheikh and Asema Iko Wagon Pamoja Adita Mati. Alberto Tuko Pamoja Adita Mati. 10.30 is the time frame. My name is Michelle Ashira. Follow me across all my social media platforms. That is as simple as Michelle Ashira. And right about now, Finoche is taking over on the ground and DJ Rajis got you covered on the wheel. So money is going to be performed live here by none other than Finoche. Yeah, 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 uh, yeah, 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 uh, 
Yeah. Welcome to Nairobi, where each and every artist is trying to make it up. He or she doesn't have money. <laughs> That's what's up, man. <laughs> yeah. Money, 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 money.